there is always more to learn and always something more to achieve the impossible is not the fixed point it is possible if you are willing to put in the work never wait for a right moment the only word to learn is now start now with self and the results will automatically falls in place and without further delay let's move on to today's topic that is on relations so this is related to mfcs dms and dmgt now the concept today is min sets so we are going to solve a problem of min sets with the three subsets so here is an example let a is equal to 1 comma 2 comma 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 find the min sets generated by the first subset b1 is equal to 5 comma 6 comma 7 b2 is equal to 2 comma 4 comma 5 9 10 and b3 is equal to 3 4 5 6 8 9 10 so we have to find the min sets and how to find the min sets first of all the thing is what is the main set here the main set a is given as 1 to 10 here so here it is the main set and see these three are the subsets first of all we have to find the complements for each and every subset here see here this is the main set and this is the subset so the complement for this one is other than 5 6 7 so if you take this 5 6 7 what are the numbers here 1 comma 2 comma 3 4 8 9 and 10 so this is the complement and next one b2 is 2 4 5 9 10 so if you eliminate from the main set that is 2 4 5 9 and 10 the rest are see here this is 1 3 6 7 8 so if you cancel all these so the remaining one is the complement so other than b2 is the complement see here what is b3 3 here so there is 3 so write 1 2 here and 6 4 5 6 are there so there is no 7 so write 7 here and next one 8 9 10 are there so these are the complements so after finding the complements so you have to find the min sets and how to find these min sets so if there are three subsets here and see there will be two cube min sets two cube means eight min sets so we have to find out the eight min sets for the following question here how to find the min sets see here first of all write there are three subsets b1 b2 and b3 see here i'm writing b1 b2 b3 so we need eight subsets b1 b2 b3 so write for eight times b1 b2 b3 and next one b1 this is b2 and this is b3 this is b1 b2 b3 b1 b2 b3 see here 1 2 3 4 5 6 two more times so this is b1 this is b2 and this one is b3 and next one is this is b1 b2 and this one is b3 see here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so how to find out this min sets see first of all this one is a1 so this one is a1 this one is a2 this one is a3 this one is a4 so this is a5 a6 a7 so this one is a8 so how to remember this so min sets means so you have to make an intersection for each and every subset so if you make an intersection so we'll be getting the minimum elements common elements and therefore it is a minimum set so if you keep an union it will be maximum sets so here i'm keeping intersection b1 for 8 times b2 for 8 times b3 for 8 times so for finding the min sets so you have to calculate the intersection part and now what is it so the logic here is the first thing here which you have to learn is so first one is b1 intersection b2 intersection b3 clear and the next one so take the complement so here take complement in the third case take the complement here take the complement for b3 so remember b1 b2 b3 complements and next one so i have taken one one complement and next time we have to take two two complements combination here one two and next one two three and next one three one so this is three one and next one all the three at once so this is how you have to remember then it will be very very easy the first thing the min sets how you have to find out is 
write b1 for 8 times b2 for 8 times and b3 for 8 times for minimum sets we have to find the intersection part so i have kept all the intersection so i am writing this in an improper way in order to make it easy for you so i am giving you a shortcut that see here first of all leave it as it is b1 intersection b2 intersection b3 intersection single single you have to give complement that is b1 intersection here b2 intersection here b3 intersection here and next one two two at a time b1 intersection b2 intersection b2 b3 and b3 b1 and next one the whole complements the three all of the three at once so these are the min sets so we have to find the values of all these sets as you know that intersection means the common elements between the three sets as we have b1 b2 b3 b1 complement b2 complement b3 complement all the six values are ready here so b1 b2 b3 so among b1 b2 b3 so what is the common element here 5 is there 5 is there and 5 is there so 5 6 is there 6 is not there and 6 is there so 6 is not common 7 check for 7 there is no 7 so only 5 is the common element for b1 b2 1 b3 like that check for b1 complement b2 b3 so here is b1 complement this is b2 and this one is b3 so you have to find the intersection and we have to find the set values and those are all the min sets so that is what i am going to show that so all the eight values you see here i have made easy for you so these are the six values first one is b1 b2 b3 and this is b1 complement b2 complement and b3 complement all the six values are ready and i know that a1 is nothing but the three intersections so five is the common element among all these three therefore a1 is equal to this five and next one a2 is nothing but b1 complement b2 b3 so b1 complement i have written from here and next one so this is b2 and this value is a b3 so among all these the common elements are 4 comma 9 comma 10 so if you observe here 4 9 and 10 are the common elements b3 so give complement to b2 and this is these are all the three values and 6 is the common element and therefore a3 value is equal to 6 b4 so after finding all these there is no common element therefore it is a null set and a, among a5 so 2 to 8 time so b1 complement b2 complement intersection b3 so all the three sets are ready and the common elements are 3 comma 8 and among a6 b1 complement b2 complement and b3 complement so among all these three sets is 7 is complement element therefore a6 is equal to 7 and next one b1 complement b3 complement so among all these two is the complement common element and therefore a7 is equal to 2 and a8 is equal to 1 so here b1 complement b2 complement b3 complement so these are all the values so these are all the values for the min sets so after finding all these see here i'm writing as i have shown you very clearly how to write this so a1 value is nothing but 5 and next one a2 value is nothing but 4 comma 9 comma 10 and see a3 value is equal to 6 you can check the values and next one a4 value is equal to empty set so this is an empty set so while you are doing see here check so this is 3 comma 8 this value is 7 and this value is equal to 2 and this value is equal to single turn set 1 so these are all the min set values so these are all the these are all the min set values here so these are all the eight values the min set why did we get the eight min sets because we have three subsets so the number of min sets value is equal to see here two cube so two to the power of three which is equal to eight and therefore how to represent these min sets using the venn diagram see here so these are all the min sets so b1 for eight times b2 for eight times and b3 for eight times the first thing you leave as it is the second one takes single complements b2 complement and next one b3 complement take two two at a time and next one three at a time so these are all the complements which you can show it in the venn diagram see first thing is a1 is equal to b1 intersection b2 intersection b3 so this is b1 b2 and b3 so the intersection part here is a1 so write a1 here clear and next one coming to a2 so what is a2 here so please neglect this one so b2 b3 intersection so b2 b3 intersection part is nothing but a2 and next one if you see a3 b1 b3 so this is b1 and b3 and this will be a3 
and next one coming to a4 so b1 b2 intersection so this is b1 b2 intersection is nothing but a4 clear and next one coming to a5 so this is a5 here so if you observe a5 here so here this will be a1 a2 a3 so clearly a5 is nothing but without complement what is there here b3 so write a5 in b3 and next one a6 so there are two complements here without complement b1 so write a6 here and next one a7 so b2 is left over this is a7 so here b1 complement b2 complement and b3 complement according to the de morgan's law b1 union b2 union b3 whole complement so this can be written as b1 union b2 union b3 union whole complement so this part is union and the other than this part is nothing but the union therefore a8 will be outside and this is how we have to show represent in the venn diagram all these means it's representation of the means it's using the venn diagram so this is also so easy if you follow these so write b1 for eight times b2 for eight times and b3 for eight times and first one you leave it as it is second one single single complement b1 b2 b3 and next one two two times b1 b2 complement b2 b3 complement b3 and b1 complement and next one whole three complements so the representation also very easy so for all the three intersection part this is a1 so here b2 b3 intersection so b2 b3 intersection is a2 and next one b1 b3 intersection is a3 and b1 b2 intersection is a4 and next one whichever you find without complement you write so a6 is b1 see here if you write see here b1 is a6 and b7 is b2 and b8 you have to write using de morgan's law it is outside the venn diagram so these are all the min set values the min set values are also very clearly explained and these are the eight min sets formed using the three subsets so this is how you have to follow so this is also very easy if any problem is given of this kind you can make a complements and you can find the min sets and this is uh, the way you have to remember the formula about diagram and everything hope you all guys understand if you really understand you know what to do please raise that um, follow this channel and i'll be uploading the maxits in my next video and have a look at those uh, videos it will be very very helpful this is the most important topic and please remember to subscribe thank you so much